story of the Margate Creative Writing Group really begins earlier this year, 2020. What a strange year that's been. January, February time, we had a few meetings. About 20 people came at our height. We didn't really know what was going to happen with the group, and we certainly didn't know what was going to happen with the year. We focused on something different every week. It was about finding local people in Margate who love to write. This week we were working on dialogue, and it was that week that the lockdown was announced. Hello, my name's April Austin and I've been writing poetry or prose and journaling most of my life. Um, I've been writing with the Margate Writing School group for, um, well, since February, but unfortunately due to COVID, we've had to do most of our classes on Zoom um, since about March, I believe, um, which has been sad, but it's kept us going. And there's been a core group that have written together and kept each other sort of feeling positive and picked each other up when we've not been feeling so good. Um, I've had a couple of poems published in a couple of different publications over the years and I put my poetry and prose on Instagram at Moonstone Bright Poetry. Um, but with the Margate group we've written quite a lot this year together, we've really worked hard and uh, we've produced some really good work and it's just been lovely to work with such a nice group of people and to get to know them and to get to know Helen Marsh as well. Uh, thank you. Me, which is nice. Hi, my name is Sharmella Barakara um, and I'm a member of the Margate Creative Writers Group well, yeah, but... Okay, listen, this is the bad, bad shit. What? Junk. The junk. But don't worry, I've just been fucking around with it. Um, I am a social worker by trade, um, and I happened to discover the writing group um, completely by accident. Do you shoot, Michael? Tell me right now, are you shooting? No, of course not. How much, Michael? It's just once in a while. You doing that shit in here, in our home? I was in Margate uh, on a work task uh, in January of 2020. Um, I'd never been to Margate, um, but I had to stop in town to get some art supplies to work with a young person. Um, and I saw this wonderful building and I was really curious about what went on there and there was a poster on um, the door advertising the first of the creative writing groups meetings and I was really intrigued um, because I loved Margate I, I just thought it was beautiful the minute I drove in um, and I, it started from there, um, and I came. I went to the very first meeting, and which I think was in February, late February maybe. Um, and I remained with it and with um, the group. What brought us together, I think, was a love of writing. Most of us didn't really want the hard-hitting feedback. I think we wanted a lot of confidence boosting, a lot of somebody saying, yes, you have permission to do writing. Just give yourself some time, have a think, and express yourself. We all loved creativity, creative writing. Some of us were published already, not everybody. But we really found that protected time once a week, three hours, to think about ourselves, reflect on our journey, and do some writing, and then share it with each other in a very supportive, um, non-critical place. That was what was so precious. Hi everyone, my name is Jennifer Colby Carey, and I'm 56 years of age, and I live in Margate on a good old Thanet planet. I've been happily married for some 26 years and consider myself lucky to a French national, Jean-Philippe, I won't get into Brexit. I use the pseudo name of Cat as they are my favourite pet and we are owned by two of them. 
I have a supernatural fantasy sci-fi novel published, although being just the one. I have been writing for many years and come across the Margate School of Writing, which is tutored by Helen just before COVID. We are fortunate to have met for three sessions before the dreaded lockdown. Now, thanks to Zoom, we continue to write using prompts and read our work to each other. We are a very prolific, informal, friendly group and enjoy welcoming other writers. My favourite genres are science fiction, supernatural and thrillers. In fact, anything that I might be inspired by during periods of spontaneous creativity. I use these genres in poetry, prose, micro and flash fiction. But we've been meeting every week um, by Zoom and I've really been quite grateful for the guidance and support of the group and also for the wonderful generosity of Helen Marsh, um, our, our group leader, as well as the wonderful voices, encouragement, and compassion of all my fellow group members. Um, the group helps me to keep joy alive through writing, um, especially in this time uh, when isolation is pandemic, you know, um, and it keeps me uh, connected to the creative energy. Hello, my name's Hayley and um, I've been writing for a number of years, but I've not had anything published. I just really do it for um, my own well-being and because it's something that I really enjoy. Get my bot on, your shoes, we've got that appointment. What appointment? Here we go. Ouch, don't be so rough. But coming to the Margate School for the creative writing group was the first time I've ever done anything um, like that, apart from when I was um, doing my undergraduate degree. Oh, Mum, have you knocked yourself again? Look at those bruises. It's nothing. Can we go now? So it was the first time we'd really come together with other um, writers. And... And I think it was just an opportunity to kickstart my passion again. Have you told her about the appointment? Um, and it's been such a, a supportive group. I think the fact that we met within the Margate School, the art school, was really supportive. It gave such a creative vibe from the outset. And the Margate School themselves have been so supportive of our writing group. That was very special. It's a wonderful building, the old Woolworths building on Margate High Street. And I think the work that's gone into turning it into a, an art school and getting that off the ground has just been really inspirational for all of us. And we just wanted to support that with our brand of creativity, which was writing. And the fact that we only sort of give each other positive feedback, I think has been really, um, really important. What you're doing. Am I seeing Dr. Warner today, love? Yes, Mum. I think it's disgusting. I've been to those places and they're gross. Um, one of the things I found that is that I take criticism very personally. And it's not something that you, you kind of have to get over that, don't you? But um, it can sometimes take a very long time to... Um, to not take it personally because uh, when we write creatively it's our it's our own work and uh, we put a lot into it so um, yeah it's hard when somebody gives you feedback that you maybe take not quite the way they meant it uh, so I think that's a really positive experience from the group and since we've been in lockdown since um, March when we went into lockdown we've carried on our group in Zoom it's just been um, such an inspiration to keep going and keep writing and I think it's kept all of our spirits up and we've actually become very good friends. Um, so, But I do look forward to an opportunity to get back into the Margate School and uh, meet up again with some of the other group members. Um, 
because it's always interesting to hear people's stories and what they're working on and uh, our voice is also different so um, I hope uh, by looking at our magazine and hearing some of our work tonight that you really enjoy it and uh, yeah I look forward to the opportunity to present to you all. Hope mum. No I'm not going out today love. See she wants to stay here. Hi, this is Jeannie. Um, I write science fiction, fantasy, and romance with the uh, LGBTQ um, characters and activity. And I am uh, part of the Margate Creative Writing Group. Uh, I just joined recently. Um, I'm, I live in California and while well, the group is uh, holed up in the uh, United Kingdom, uh, I am actively participating um, at least once a week. Uh, I really enjoy the group. I like uh, studying about writing and finding uh, different methods uh, to um, take my writing to a higher level or um, just learn about other writers and how they write. So um, my, my work with the Margate creative writing group has been uh, very uh, different from other critique groups I've participated in. I do, um, I like the way that Helen guides us uh, through different styles. And I like the other participants. Uh, they're very good writers and all have uh, their own unique voice that uh, tells me, um, a lot about them as as people and uh, I'm getting to know quite a few uh, quirks and 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 uh, elements to their writing style through uh, getting to know them so uh, I do enjoy the group again and I uh, hope that you'll be uh, enjoying it just as much as I do bye well, thank you again for giving us this opportunity to share our work with you and hope to see you tonight. Bye. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Thanks for listening, watching, whatever. <laughs>